Wajia County Wajia Town is the capital of the expansive county which appears at the end tail of the list of the healthiest counties in Kenya. It has 158 health facilities. The county women representative Hatuma Gedi organized for a two-day medical camp at the heart of the town for all to attend. <laughs> Hundreds of people turned up to participate in the free medical checkup and treatment by the specialists and nurses. <laughs> The women representative of Kirinyaga, Miss Piriti Ngurishi, who also serves as the chairperson of the Kenya Women Parliamentary Association, Kewopa, termed the event as success, adding that she would urge other women elected leaders to follow suit. Assalamu alaikum. Uh, Nashkuru sana leo uh, kwa kuja huku kwenyu. Na nimefurahia sana kwamba dadangu Fatma ame nialika hapa. Bwana CS, nataka kusema asante sana pia kwa kukuja kufanya launching. Hiyo ni kusema kwamba serikali kuu iko pamoja na sisi ama haiko pamoja na sisi. Fatma ni mdogo kuniliko lakini wakati nilichaguliwa kama chair wao katika Kenya Women Parliamentary Association, Kewopa. Alikuja akaniambia mama mimi nataka nikuje kwako nifanye benchmarking nione alafu nipeleke wapi wajir akakuja akapata tulikuwa na medical camp akakuja na yeye amewaletea nini kidogo kidogo kwa hivyo kila mahali akipata kidogo anawalete anawaletea si ndio she was echoed by the devolution cabinet secretary Eugene Wamalwa who held the free medical camp saying it goes a long way in promoting the government's efforts to provide free and affordable health care officially launched sawa sawa you have a role to play to complement what the county government is doing sawa sawa nawaambia leo tumealikwa hapa na mama wa county hii kwa ajili anapenda watu wa county yake na amesema leo wapewa matibabu ya bure bila kulipa chochote nizindue hii medical eh, camp ambayo mtapata matibabu ya bure sio leo tu nimesikia nilipaka kesho sio paka kesho hata kama una mgonjwa hajafika leo tafadhali kesho mlete hapa tena madawa kuna madawa ya kutosha kuna madaktari wa kutosha na watapewa huduma ya bure through muheshimiwa Fatuma Gedi mheshimiwa wenu The two day project served 1757 people and 100 others booked for the upcoming similar events set for the wards across the county. According to the lead specialist at the event, Dr. Jonathan Irungu, over 13 people were diagnosed with cervical and breast cancer. 
He said most of the unsuspecting patients assumed they were dealing with a normal wound when in fact it was a cancer cell growing in their bodies. The service seekers enjoyed free diabetic, tuberculosis, fistula, arthritis and gynecological checkup. They were also checked for blood glucose, blood pressure, general consultation and treatment. The camp is now slated for the grassroots areas before the end of the year. <laughs>